Oh, Giles is here. <laughs> Giles was here. Giles, going on here. Giles, Giles we, we need you over here, my love. <laughs> <laughs> Giles, so, so sorry. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Sorry, Barbara. Giles, <laughs> we, we, I'll get before money. the weather came, Giles, we were going to do something quite, quite oh, special <laughs> outside. <laughs> we, 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 is this happening? We're, doing no, we're live we're on not, TV yeah, now, yeah. Giles. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello. <laughs> I, I, all I've been thinking about is if this happens in London tomorrow, yeah. it's going to be a bit bleak. Really? You've all got to take umbrellas to the Abbey, haven't well, you? Well, maybe it's a good you idea to take umbrellas. You turned it round You did it's turn gonna it round. But I don't know that the King and the Queen want to go to a pub just off <laughs> Westminster. <laughs> but still, anyway, here we are. They can this end up in the a, Talking Duck. This is such an exciting yeah. moment. So listen, it talk really us is. through uh, what we're going to do when the, when the weather essentially clears. We have the cobble cap. We have a golden cobble. Cap. Yeah. And the idea is to commemorate an historic moment in British cultural history, the coming together of two iconic programmes. Yes. This morning and Coronation Street. Coming together in the same place for this coronation. So this and is we've and have it there. And we've, we've got right royalty here. We've got Bill, we've got Maureen, we've got... <laughs> oh, my God, we've got the whole we've team. We've got the Queen. <laughs> we've got the, the, the Queen. Hi, Barbara. And, and he used okay. to stand in for the Duke of... You know when the Duke of Edinburgh was busy? They got Ken in. And then he said, will you walk with your hands behind your back and do a, do your Duke of Edinburgh impression? It's so good. Oh. Put your hand, that's it, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> So good. But Dame Maureen, would yes. you please read what is on the golden... Yeah, we want to see this plaque. beautiful plaque. Let's take a look. Here's, here's a plaque that's not on any of our teeth. Right, are you ready? <laughs> this is going to be placed on a couple. It says... It is, on it's a couple for all time, for people when they come maturity. on the tour at the weekends, oh, forever so and ever. Forever. Amen. Would you please read what's going to be on the plaque? It says, Coronation Street and This Morning celebrated the coronation of H.M. King Charles III on these cobbles. 5th of May, 2023. Beautiful. Oh, oh, I love that. That is lovely. Uh, uh, it's going out in the street. It's we're going to choose. But we're not doing it in the street now, are we? We're not doing it in the street. We were supposed to be doing it right now. Because of the weather, your contract said that when there's the weather pause, we have to come indoors. Maureen came prepared. She's got a hat. I'm happy to just lie down for a few months with this. I'll just lie on the floor. We've got... The, the final three cheers will be done outside, presumably, will well, it? Oh, we hope so. We we see if hope. Not... But if not, they'll be heard, not just outside, but all over the world, because Coronation Street is now seen in, I think, 32 Literally. different countries. Yes. Yes. So it's quite amazing. It's big yeah. in Canada, isn't it? Very yeah. big in Canada. Were you there on the amazing. first day in December 1960? When I was. Yeah, no, you were. We watched you. <laughs> we've grown up with you. Yeah, no, yeah. I wasn't. As we've got older, you've gone younger. <laughs> he's well, made, he's uh, made as it. we've <laughs> got older, you've gone younger. Uh, yeah, and a bit deafer. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't need that. Yes, well, thank you for that, Giles. <laughs> and so have you. Yes. You're obviously <laughs> very well. A pair of us. Well, you're yeah. obviously yeah. doing something right. I don't know what. Portrait but... of Dorian Gray in the attic, <laughs> yes. possibly. Yes. <laughs> yeah. mm. All right. So, so we listen. We're really excited because obviously we've got Barbara Knox here. Oh, give her Barbara, can, Barbara, can, can we, invi can we invite you to the yes. booth? Come and join us. Come and join us in the booth. Yeah. 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 Right. Barbara Knox, everybody. Hello. We've got Sally excited. and Michael coming in as well when they can. Yeah. Oh, it's so lovely to see you. So Barbara, the Queen of give the Cobbles. Over. Come on. <laughs> Julie but everybody Goodyear calls you that. claimed that years ago. She always said, but you, to you, I'm the queen of the street. Well, she's passed the you mantle did, down to you. You man. probably That's don't realise that everyone is actually saying that all the time. They do. They do. Yeah. Tell us about... Me. Tell us about... Could, but all, in all seriousness, congratulations on the MB. It's a marvellous thing. Tell us oh, about... Isn't it nice? Tell us about the, the day and when did you find out? Ah, I got a letter, I think, if I remember rightly. Yeah. Um... Well, all that, you know, with the excitement, you're going, oh, my God, oh, my God, is this true? And, of course, subsequently, it did happen. Yeah. And it was, as anyone will tell you, magnificent. Yeah. Was quite overwhelming on the day. I mean, what was it like on the day? Totally. <laughs> totally. I think you did a bit of PR for the, for the show, didn't you, to the Queen? You actually said, why don't you watch the show? Oh, <laughs> who told you that? <laughs> I know everything, Bob. <laughs> I know everything. Is it, 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 was, is it true? It, it's true. Uh, Paul O'Grady had asked me, would I go on his chat show? And yeah. I've never done one. And I said, no, I'm no good at that sort of thing. Anyway, he persuaded me. So I went to the palace and got it on that day. And the day after, in the evening, I was doing his show. And he said to me, you know, how did it go? And it's very frightening. And, oh, oh, but Her Majesty is 
wonderful. She's so calm, isn't she? She is one in every thousand million. She knows how to put you at your ease. Yeah. And I must have got a little bit sort of thinking, oh, I've cracked this. And I suddenly said to her, if you're not doing anything <laughs> on the 9th, our birthday's the 9th of December, we're going to do a fabulous show. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? I, I couldn't believe I'd done that. I truly could not believe that was the one thing I'd been very polite and quiet and frightened. I don't know why I did that. It was coming to the end of the interview, if you like to no, call it. No, but it's a nice thing to yeah. say. You just wanted to, to watch the but show. But she it's made lovely. you feel relaxed. Yeah. I can talk to this lady. The yeah. fact that she's queen. Yeah, but, you know, that's, and, that's when, and people are people, right? I mean, if people are disarming, then you're just going to engage with them and vice versa. I don't know. She had that magic. Yeah. She definitely had that magic and wanted you to be happy. Well, and the other thing, when she came here uh, last May, I think it was, whatever, and we were, Bill and uh, Audrey, Sue, yeah. were lined up. And um, this is how she was remarkably quick. Everyone will tell you that. And as she was about to leave, yeah. I just suddenly went, Mom. And she said, yes. I said, I want to thank you. It was my MBE. I want to thank you for this. I do love it. Thank you very much. Oh. And instantly, she just said, did you have a lovely day? Oh. Now, you know, I could have tricked her in a way by... She didn't know I was going to speak to her. I have the nerve to say that. Yeah. But instantly, did you have a lovely she day? She knew how to react. She knew what to do. God. Michael, I don't know how you just snuck in here, but I'm very impressed with you. <laughs> I just, <laughs> so, I, very, I mean, I mean the quickness of the hand to see the iron. I we stood in my house there and then the heavens opened. Yeah. Not even seen him all day and suddenly he's in I looked out the window and it was an empty street. <laughs> <laughs> and we stood there and I'm thinking, where's everyone gone? Yeah. <laughs> Help! And then so, someone come to find me. But... Was, was there a reason why you came? It had to be one person there you was, came here for. I came and I had the king's keys to present to. <laughs> Josie. Well, she's here. Where is she? She's here. Kevin! <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice relationship. I'm a bit shorter than real life, aren't I? A little, little bit. Yeah, a little, little bit shorter. You're still a fine red wine. Well, you are still, still a fine, fine red, red wine. wine. Thank you. Yeah. Um, I had a lovely quiche for you as well. Did you make it yourself? No, no. No, no. It's so good. It's got a soggy bottom now, though. What, what flavour was it? It's the King's quiche. It's the King's quiche, yeah. but it's a soggy King's quiche. It doesn't look very appetising, to be honest. JC is not going to judge you for a soggy bottom, my friend. No, absolutely not. You're, you're not selling yourself. No. You're not selling yourself. Oh, oh Rita! No. I know. I love you so much. I've been getting so starstruck. I've been going back and oh, oh it's it's Rita. It's so brilliant. Do you get that all the time, though? Do people call you Rita? Do they call you by your, your character oh, name yes. all the time? Yes, it's understandable, isn't it? Yeah, really. Well, you're part of her, aren't you? Yeah. Well, you're there you go. How long have I been here? So, very, very few times I get oh. Barbara, but I don't care. Oh. Isn't that marvellous? Yeah. yeah. She Isn't shows people engaged. Yeah. But, you life. know, you get a job, it's She's been wonderful, you. you're there, and friends, neighbours, strangers, Rita, from all over the world. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, it really is. Oh, Michael, you God. had an experience with the late Queen as well. Was this about the Gigi's? is that right? Yeah, when, when she came here, so I just thought, what am I going to say to her? I'm, she didn't answer me back, but I've got a horse and it's called Monty. You've got after... a horse as well? Yes, yeah, got... I've got Ooh. three. I've got three horses. <laughs> And, uh, it's getting a better, better day for Chelsea, isn't it? <laughs> it's better and better. And one of them's called Monte, named after Monte Roberts, who used to train the Queen's horses. Right. So ah. I says, oh, well, I've got a horse called Monte, named after Monte Roberts. And uh, she just looked at me and went, nice. Amazing. Yeah. I know, and that was it. But... <laughs> so good, though. But it, you know, Next thing you know, just... she's there going, stick five on that each way. Yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> just, just something different. To oh, say rather than love your shoes. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So. And Sally, you've got an MBE as well. I have. What yes. was that like oh. when you received that? Amazing. Maybe one day you will meet without one, is there? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? I don't know. You'll get it eventually. You'll get yeah. it eventually. What's it like? So Does I it get it... you any freebies? No, I don't think so. No, I was asking that. No, I didn't get you anything. Um, so it was during the pandemic, and I was doing Dancing on Ice at the time. So it was like rehearsing Dancing on Ice so good quickly to um, the Windsor Castle. 
Castle, met Princess Anne, which was wonderful because oh. she's so nice. Is she good fun? Oh my God, I, I felt as though I just wanted to sit down with her and have a chat. But yeah. she knew everything. She said, why are you doing Dancing on Ice? And I was like, I know, <laughs> <laughs> tell me about it. Um, but she was lovely and it was a really, really special day. I really enjoyed it. And we weren't there very long because of the pandemic again, but it was lovely to be invited. What about your MBE? Tell us about well, like when you got that. I mean, that must have been incredible, huh? Yeah, um, yeah, it was. It was an amazing day. It was literally in and out, though, but it was lovely. We I really enjoyed it. it I'm just great. looking over your shoulder, <laughs> Sally, and I'm looking at Phil Vickery. He's absolutely <laughs> drenched. <laughs> <laughs> Did you bring any sandwiches across? I was going to carry on, actually. <laughs> <laughs> no sandwiches. A little bit of water, a bit wet. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I remember as well? Michael, I remember your first episode when you two met, and obviously, I remember back in the day, we loved your... We always want you to get back together, but I remember, wow. you, I think you was in a pair of white leggings, maybe a leather jacket. Oh, no, you had white boots on. White plastic white boots. boots. Plastic boots. Yeah, you a had a leather jacket. plastic jacket. jacket. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. I'll never forget yeah. that. And that chemistry, as soon as you was on camera, on camera was unbelievable, wasn't it? Well, we've known each other, haven't we, since we were 13. Yeah, so we, we, we used to go to all the workshop together. Workshop together really? So yeah. We've known each other. Do you think your characters will ever get back together? Because you know that's what? what we all want, you all our what? 90s babies. I hope not. Because I think, I think, <laughs> no, I mean, I mean that in a nice way because I think you and uh, Johnny work so well together and me and the other Sally, I, I love working with her as well and it just gives, gives us something different to do, doesn't it, really? Yeah. yeah. You know, I love the charge. I, I love working with, with Sally, yeah. don't get me wrong, you know, but... Uh, <laughs> but is it long enough? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, 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 love this. I was thinking about that. I looked down at my notes and I was like, well, listen to this. OK, they got married in 86, had two children, then the, uh, then shock affair with Denise Welsh. Yeah. 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 Oh, that was very good, by the way. <laughs> very well read. Uh, saw them fall out of love, separate in 97, eventually getting back in uh, 2002. And you'd think that was it then, wouldn't you? You'd think so. Yeah. Only yeah. for it to fall apart in 2009. Oh, no. What are these writers doing to us? Uh, well, Michael's been a couple yeah, for 40 married years. Married twice, That's it. We? Yeah. But it is all about the storylines, and obviously, Barbara, you've had so I'll many amazing storylines, yeah. and sometimes I feel that maybe there's a big responsibility on you with some of these storylines. I mean, how did which storylines have stayed with you, and you thought, oh? I've got to take this quite seriously. This the is The one that everyone talks about when you meet them is the tram oh, in Blackpool. Yeah. yeah, that was that, amazing. That, that amazing. was... The story was so beautifully yeah. placed from the me and the man falling out yeah. and me discovering that he's the dead oak, he's having my money, he's got other women and yeah. one thing and another. Then she has a, me, has a little bit of a breakdown in Blackpool and all of that. She's really, really upset about that. And, and then he comes to find me and, of course, that marvellous death. Barbara, you don't have a good time with them trams, do you? <laughs> 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 a bit of superstition uh, there. Uh, well, they put... A, uh, there's a a lamppost outside the digs that I was supposed to stay in and, and they had a, for a very long time, you know, Rita and the tram was here and what have That's you. That's great. He's what is it, for a long you time. I mean, this, you know, the show's been going on so long. What is it that brings the public back and, and what is it about the show? You know, it's such a privilege for us to be here. What is it about the show that resonates so much with, with people? I think because they believe us. But that's really the bottom of it, isn't it? When... They love us yeah. and or hate us and they let you know and they become very fond of you and yeah. they like to see you. And you make them laugh, you know. That's what I love, oh, what I love about the show. I tune in and, and never know I'm going to get laughs. And you make us cry as well. Oh, cry, yes. laugh, absolutely everything. Yes. Um, yes. Wow, what a privilege it's been to you be. You make yes. us laugh. Uh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs>